Today, we are gonna fix Microsoft VB script runtime error problem. Before moving on to the video, don't forget to leave a like. The solution consists of two steps. The first step is to delete the VBS files that don't work using the Windows Auto Runs program. To do this, we need the Windows Auto Runs program. To download this program, we open our browser and go to Microsoft's website. The download link for the program will be in the description. We downloaded auto runs. Now we right click on the downloaded zip file. Then click on extract all. And then click on extract. We can now delete the zip file. If our computer is 32 bit, we need to open auto runs. But if it is 64 bit, we need to open auto run 64. Since my computer is 64 bit, I am right clicking on auto run 64. After this, we run the program as an admin. Once the program is open, there is a short scanning process that we need to wait for. After the scan is complete, we type VBS in the search bar. After doing this, we need to right click and delete the results that are highlighted in red, which indicate non-functional files. I have done this before, so it doesn't appear for me, but I can provide an example with something other than VBS. As you can see, format factory shell is not working right now. I right click on it and then click on delete. After typing VBS, you need to do the same for the red results that appear. Once we have deleted the non-functional files, we can close the program. Now, in order to restore the deleted VBS files, we need to verify our system files. To do this, we go to the search section and run CMD as an admin. Once CMD is open, we type SFC slash scan now and press enter. This process will take some time as it scans for missing or corrupted system files. The scanning process is complete. Now we need to restart our computer. After restarting your computer, you can check if the problem is solved or not. We have come to the end of the video. I hope this video was useful for you. If the video helped you, don't forget to like the video. You can also subscribe to my channel to support me. Take care and see you in the next video.